So either I'm gonna get detention, one day out school suspension, or no punishment. Or a punishment they're not gonna tell me today, I'm like, before this video gets started, I just want to say it's a little bit confusing and I kind of got confused explaining, but I tried my best and maybe in the future where I know more stuff, I will update this again and it'll be a little more understanding. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy. What's up guys, it's Stefan. Today I have a very dumb story to tell you guys. I've been wanting to rant about school for a while, just like different things, trying to get small topics, but here is a very, very big topic. So I'm not going to mention anyone's names, just hopefully you guys can follow along when I'm saying she and like, I'll get there. So in one of my classes, I'm not going to say which one it is. <laughs> One of my classes, um, okay, <laughs> so hard to explain. Someone was sitting two spots over from me, and then there was like an open spot because the girl was gone, me, another girl, a guy, and then this other girl, okay. So this other girl, someone, like one of my friends behind me was sitting behind me, and you know that she was talking to herself. So like, all of a sudden she got up and she started yelling my teacher's name, she's like, meh, 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 and like by the time she was like, she said it like four or five times, by the time she was done saying it, she was just full on screaming, so I'm like, um, what is, like, does she need something? Like, I didn't know what she needed, I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> but, my jaw just crashed. She's like, can you tell him to stop being mean to me? Like, no one was, no one said anything to her. She sat down and started talking to herself. He's like, can you tell her, him, she said, can you tell him to stop saying dumb crap about me? And then she just started calling him a female dog. And I'm like, thinking to myself, lady, what, what's happening? Stop being... A donkey and she's like maybe you should talk to your beach about that and like she literally said like four times the only thing you could pronounce like pronounce hear from her are swear words like she just started throwing f-bombs like calling people b word and like she was throwing them like huh so all of a sudden my teacher's like um go out in the hallway now and like there's two doors to my classroom and like they're like both like that there's a tiny wall like why well, I, I don't know but um so she opened it and like he walked out and then like he closed that door, and then <laughs> I don't know why he thought maybe there's Hannah Montana marathon running, and he's like, Hannah Montana! He closed that door and walked to the other one and like walked out and then closed that and started talking to her. A few seconds later, he came in, and like the two people sitting next to me, because like she sits on the other side of them, he's like, you two, out now. And I'm like, um, what is happening? So when they came back in, he called that other girl back out, like the student helper was, not a student helper, a, a teacher, but like, there's like teachers who just help around the school for like, kids who like need extra help and one of them was in there and she's like what the is going on so like then the girl sitting next to me started explaining she's like I walked in like she always looks at people just to see like what they're wearing like she doesn't do it meanly but the way she looks like someone could take it the wrong way so that's what happened so like that happened and she's like telling me like nothing happened and then the, the guy sitting next to her was like I didn't even do anything I just kind of looked like well guys I live in Minnesota it's like literally like freezing so much the past few days and she was wearing a belly shirt so they were like okay why is she doing that I just kind of kept it to myself and in my mind so like other than that I would have probably gotten in trouble too but no one no one needs to be in trouble here till the end of the story a few seconds later he came in and like the two people sitting next to me because like she sits on the other side of them he's like you too out now and I'm like um what is happening so when they came back in he called that other girl back out like the student helper was not a student helper so she started walking out and then all of a sudden, she I think she was mumbling to herself, then all of a sudden she turned to the guy and tried flicking him off, but she didn't, like, know what she was doing. She was, like, looking, she's like, like, okay, what are you trying to do? The girl sitting two seats down from me, which technically is next to me, there's just an open spot. She's like, hey, don't flick him off, because she knows she he didn't do anything wrong. So, <laughs> the girl's, like, tried, like, she flicked him off, and then she flicked, like, the rest of the class off, and we're like, okay, what the heck? So now the girl stood up, and she's like, hey don't flick him off and then they started getting up at each other's faces and meanwhile I'm sitting there I'm just like ready to hit, ready to hit like from someone flying in the back of me I'm just bracing myself and then all of a sudden like the girl who was like said don't like yell like flick him off she's like what are you gonna do hit me like she put her hands behind her back because she didn't want to like hit first like she didn't want to get hit she just was like trying to be like what are you gonna do like there's no reason you should be doing this and the guy like so like the way, the, this is really confusing, the way this girl sits, like there's an open spot, then there's me, then there's a guy behind her, then there's a guy next to her, like across the aisle. And the guy behind her started moving her stuff, the guy next to her like started scooting over and said, don't hit her. And then like I like just turned, like bracing myself, so all of us around us could clearly tell something probably is going to happen, we were just so nervous. And then my teacher stepped in and he's like, you office, and then the girl who's like, like standing up for the guy and like the rest of the class just sat down crying like, hey, do you want to go out in the hallway and like all this. Later on she ended up taking a walk and then the girl came back and like she sat in the back of the room and I just I was really confused how like she gotta come back after that but anyway here, here's where it goes bad. 
So my teacher like goes over to an, another school like halfway through, like he his half and half teacher, and um, I saw him in the office. I kept making eye contact with him. I'm like, oh god, he was in there for 20 minutes, and just. I don't even know what he was talking about. But then I talked to the girl early, earlier this morning. I'm so glad I did not tell the story last night because I found out way more today. So the girl comes back and she's like, so either I'm going to get detention, one day out school suspension, or no punishment. Or a punishment they're not going to tell me today. I'm like, you did nothing wrong. She's getting detention for standing up for someone. Like, you are taught to stand up for people. You are taught to... When something's going wrong or someone's- what was that noise? Someone's getting bullied to be like, hey, don't do that. That's exactly what she did. And now, she's getting detention for that. Like, I like my school. I wouldn't say I love my school, I like my school, but like, it's- Sometimes it gets a little out of hand. But like, the way, like, honestly- So you're saying that, like, when she points out for someone that, like, you're going to get, like, de It makes no sense. And I'm like, if she gets punished, I'm going down to my principal talking. I know the guy who was, like, behind her thought he was gonna get hit too. It's like- I'm going down and talk. And, like, there's no way we're letting you get in trouble. I'm like, so then today, like, she came back and like too, and she just stayed sitting in the back of the room, and like the the other helper lady was like kind of just pacing back and forth, like by her, like, please don't do anything. <laughs> She's like, I can't see the notes, so like he kind of moved her halfway up, so she was still away from us. Cause right now, like, I feel like I'm in the middle because like fight over here, fight over here. So like my whole table, I feel like she's just gonna want to yell, and like I had nothing to do with it. Please leave me alone. When it happened this day that it happened. I just, like, I need to, like, I just started hyperventilating for some reason, like, I need to go for a walk. I just took a few laps around the school, I went to the bathroom, I just tried to calm down, when I got back, like, my teacher, like, knew I just didn't go to the bathroom, because it literally takes me 30 seconds, and I was gone for, like, almost 10 minutes, and he just knew, he's like, it's fine, like, I know, so I'm like, thank you for understanding, like, this is a new teacher this year, too, and he's dealing with this, and I'm like, I am so sorry, I'm so sorry for, like, everything, but yeah, my main point of this is, like, why she was going to get detention for helping someone else. And also her mom called her right away, she's like, you're grounded, and my teacher's like, give me your mom's number, I'm gonna text her now, tell her I'm calling her later, I'm gonna get you out of trouble, because she did nothing wrong, she did everything right. Like, I understand, like, yeah, she shouldn't stand, like, maybe, I don't know. But, like, my teacher right away didn't get into it, like, he's new, and, like, he doesn't like to yell, so he's like, can you go out in the hallway, and, like, this, but then this, it's a half C. But, yeah, um, I thought that I'd just tell the story time, please check out my vlog channel down below, suggested right there and i'll see you guys very very soon with another video if you like more story times um tell me and give me some challenges to do because i'm running out of ideas but yeah i can't wait till summer because i want more videos as i say that it's not even january yet remember don't stick up for people you might get detention no please please stick up for people. Just, i don't know what happened in this situation i'm sorry I'm, 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 it, 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 as you can tell this is still affecting me i'm i'm, 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 I'm stuttering trying to explain so sorry if this is a little bit confusing